Hello everybody and welcome back to Disney Elves. Today I am going to be showing you some of my recent Disney purchases. I'm so excited, some of the stuff is second hand, some of it's new, some of it's gifted, some of it's seasonal already getting into Christmas. I've been so busy recently because myself and my husband Nikon write and release music and we have a new release coming. It is called One Big Road. It is a four track EP, so you get four songs. Uh, you can pre-order it right now on the iTunes store. It's only £3.16 and it really, really helps us. And you can pre-save it on places like Spotify, so I will leave a link in the description if you are interested in helping my dream, she's got a dream, at being a full-time singer, songwriter, musician, person. So, thank you very much, let's get into it. Now the first thing or things that I bought are second-hand, I found them on Facebook Marketplace, and it is three of the six Lost Boys plush. Now, as you guys know, I'm a massive plush collector, but the Peter Pan ones are notoriously difficult to find, expensive, a bit of a nightmare, so I managed to get three of them. Here is the first one. Forgive me, I don't know their names, but look at this one, he's so cute. I am so excited. They've just announced um, the Peter Pan and Wendy thing on Disney Plus um, from D23. Uh, all of these have their stamps as well because they're old so this is the first one and then here is the second one and this one has a tag he is so cute and these are in such good condition uh considering their age so here's what the tags would have looked like it's got the old disney store logo so cute oh this one has his name on nibs oh yeah i remember now and that's the other side of the tag and it has this little tag as well and it says like disney store california and stuff so i don't know if these were exclusive to america or something and maybe that's why they're really hard to find but he's really cute and he also has the stamp on his foot and then the third guy is this little dude i seem to remember this guy being a bit mean in the film i i really need to re-watch um peter pan because it is one of my favorites in terms of like nostalgia and the songs in peter pan i love and i love the whole meaning of never grow up so yeah like for me peter pan is more about what it means rather than the film itself like i don't re-watch it a lot but i love what it means and look at them aren't they so cute so yeah i'm really happy i've got these so there are three more but two of them are, are twins but i think they're actually different plush the twins so yeah three of six and if you're wondering these cost me oh my gosh i think they were 20 pounds each then 20, 30, 40, 40, 60 60 60 quid sounds right and then five pound postage so yeah 65 quid for all three which is really really good i think um sometimes this one is like 90 quid online and one of them has a tag and the lady who was selling them was really nice she did have one of the twins but someone bought it off her already so that's sad but at least i got these three i'm really happy about this up next let's talk about lounge fly of course there had to be some lounge fly bags in my recent purchases um first of all though i was actually gifted one by very nico i love very nico i've done a couple of live streams for them and for zabby and yeah i love their whole website is amazing i do have a discount code and all of that but i'm not being paid to say any of this i genuinely love their stuff so this is their exclusive bing bong lounge fly bag inside out 2 has just been announced at d23 which is very exciting i hope they bring bing bong back and i do have an idea of how they would do that as well so pixar call me here is the bag it's beautiful as you can see it's got the pixar lounge fly um kind of stamp it's got the candy the sweets zipper pull because of course bing bong cries sweets and then you've got him and joy oh here's your friend he likes to play a lot of the inside out merchandise is very much themed around like rainbows and the emotions which i get but i love that this is more of a purple color scheme it's so cute and the back of the bag is bing bong fading away and it says take her to the moon for me okay and that bit honestly is so so cute but so sad so yeah i absolutely love this the lining is like sweets as well let me just show you a little bit of that you can see it's got like sweets all over the lining which i just love the details the details that is exclusive 
to Very Nico. So check out their website and I will leave a link in the description below. Next up in the realm of lounge fly is one that I managed to get for an absolute steal in the Disney outlet sale. Here it is. I know people go absolutely crazy for the Disney snacks and anything themed around the Disney snacks. So on the Disney sale, there was like lounge fly, there was spirit jerseys, they had like the waffle one, they had a popcorn one, stuff like that. So I decided to get the pretzel one just because I love that this really does look like a Mickey. And I just loved the colour scheme. I don't have a lot of stuff this colour. Hey, it kind of matches my outfit today. I can't believe it. This was 30 something pounds and then I had a 10% discount on top of it. So that's crazy. If you are looking for good deals like this, I do share all of the good deals and all of the discount codes on my Instagram. So make sure you follow me on there if you like that sort of thing. I always share them in my stories. So here is this one. It's got a little zipper like at the front. You could probably just fit some coins in there or something if you were going to the park. I love it. But the best part is this bag is scented. When I found out it was scented, I was like, oh my gosh. Because I could smell something really nice in the box. But I don't know. I just, just thought it smelled nice. And um, yeah, beautiful, amazing backpack. Great price. And it's scented. I love it. Now I have to say, I appreciate every single item that I am ever gifted. I can't believe it. Don't know what I did to deserve it, but I appreciate every single item. So just wanna make that known. This was another gifted lounge fly. I can't believe it. Uh, this one is a crossbody. It is Pocahontas. Don't see enough of her. Absolutely love it. Love that it's Riverbend vibes. Here this one is. It's stunning. It's like a little bit 3D as well. Like it's kind of embroidered. Um, so you've got her, you've got Miko. And then if you do the popper at the front, it opens like that and you've got a little flit and all the colours of the wind and it's so cute. And then the inside is all of the leaves from the colours of the wind. I love the fact that they've gone for this blue colour as well because a lot of Pocahontas stuff tends to be quite brown and beige, which is not my vibe um, as much as beautiful bright blue. So this is like the cross body, so it just goes over you like that. Little kind of satchel feeling, like, you know, it's quite, um, like it, it doesn't expand or anything. It's a really sturdy bag. I really, really like that. And it's perfect for going out, perfect for the parks. Like it's a very wearable, usable one, this one. And nice to have one that isn't a backpack as well because it just gives you different options. It can be quite sweaty wearing a backpack. We've had a heat wave recently in the UK and I couldn't wear a backpack because it was just so hot on my back. That one is from my huns over at Zabby. I also have a discount code for Zabby. It's just L's E-L-Z. Yeah, I absolutely love that. So thank you Zabby for sending me that one. Another item from the Shop Disney sale. This, which cost 16 pounds down from 50. Yeah. Oh, 55. This was originally 55 pounds and it went down to 16 and then I had a 10% off code. So it was absolutely crazy cheap. And this is like a kind of woven blanket. I love these woven blankets from Shop Disney. They are the height of quality and I love it. So here you can see what the pattern will be, but I'm not getting this out yet because basically my cats are gonna destroy it in 0 0.5 seconds. So I'm gonna wait until, I don't know, I just liked it. Why did I buy something that I can't use because of me cats? <laughs> I don't know. So there's that one. Love it. Love it. It's the most wonderful time of the year all year round in my house because I bought some advent calendars early. Star Wars is for Nikon and me husband and Disney of course is for moi. Um, now did I buy Nikon the Star Wars one just so I could have the Star Wars one as well? Yes, yes I did. Basically, I've had Harry Potter ones of these before and they are amazing. They basically just give you a little tiny Funko Pop figures. Um, what's interesting about these is they look like all of them are going to be Christmas. Whereas with Harry Potter, you had some normal looking characters as well. But look at this. They're the, they're the little kind of sneak peeks. And those ones as well, the little sneak peeks that you've got. So I absolutely love that. I'm totally ready for Christmas already. Um, I suggest you get these if you want them. I don't know if they'll sell out. Sometimes the Harry Potter ones sell out. 
and sometimes they're on there still in February and they're going for really cheap. So it's up to you what risk you want to take. Um, but there's also Star Wars. Look at that. Christmassy Darth Vader. You've got a kind of snowman stormtrooper. And there is the back as well. And yeah, so I'm really excited to open those. I'm definitely going to be sharing all about those on me TikTok, me Instagram and all that. Yes, you girls on TikTok these days as well. And I'm really excited for Christmas this year. I think it's going to be a good one. I bought something from Star Wars Celebration. Well, to be honest, I bought a lot of things from the Star Wars Celebration in Anaheim. I did not go. I wish I could have gone because that would have been amazing. I am going to the one in London, but I can only go for one day because I couldn't afford the rest of it. I bought a lot of things but I wanted to show you this because I just think this needs to be seen by everyone. This is absolutely genius. It's this. So it's meant to be a towel, right? And then I read that it's like a kind of anti-sand towel which is possibly why it feels so weird. It does not feel like a towel. But to be honest, I just bought it because I thought it'd look cool hung up somewhere. I'm not gonna lie. It's Anakin and it says, I don't like sand. And then it's like... A, it's coarse, B, it's rough, and all that. It's so funny. Let me go farther back, see if you can see it all. How funny is that? Overall, I just needed that. Do you know what I mean? I'd love to meet Hayden Christensen one day. It would be epic, because I love that man. Revenge of the Sith is probably one of my absolute favourites um, from Star Wars as well. So, really loved that. Um, it's the anniversary of one of the films um so that's why they did that and then the last thing i want to show you is gifted again but i'm showing it because i love it it's another sort of blanket this is to celebrate the lilo and stitch anniversary and this is on shop disney i think this may be in the sale at the moment um or some of the things from the range are let me show you so this is one of the sort of like woven blankets again and it's just such good quality it's amazing it's massive you've got angel on there as well and it's just beautiful and it's got a sort of like tasseled edge. So that is that little stitch throw. So we've come to the end of my kind of recent Disney purchases haul. I hope you enjoyed it. Please leave it a like if you liked it. Feel free to leave me a comment. Let me know what your favourite thing was. I can't possibly choose a favourite. I bought all of this because I love it. Do you know what I mean? Don't forget that you can pre-order my EP right now on the iTunes store, One Big Road. Or you can pre-save it on places like Spotify. I'll leave as many links as possible down below to the items that I've shown. Some of them might be affiliate links. If you don't know what affiliate link is, it just means that I get a little percentage if you buy through my link. I'm just showing this because I love it, so no pressure. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys very soon. Hold on, the last thing I want to talk about is Dreamlight Valley, the new game that you can buy for early access right now. So I got it on PC through Steam, and it was only 23, 24 pounds, something like that. And I absolutely love the game. I totally recommend it to anyone. If you love anything along the lines of Animal Crossing, it reminds me a little bit of Sims in some ways, like it's kind of farming and restoring a place, a little bit Stardew Valley, so it's like all of those things, but with Disney and the music that you hear behind it is amazing, the characters that you see are so cool, uh, so I totally recommend Dreamlight Valley as a game as well. It does come out for free in 2023, <laughs> but I highly recommend paying that 20 quid and getting it right now.